Well, it's not just describing it as clashes. It's the use of the passive voice, which is practically the editorial standard for American corporate media. And so we see CNN with a headline noting that Palestinians died in Gaza. How did they die? Maybe they got old or they were sick. Uh, who's going to solve the mystery behind these deaths? We just don't know how they died because the headline just says they up and died. And so what we have to state clearly is that Israel carried out these killings in deliberate fashion. Israel has an open fire shoot to kill policy where they're not actually shooting at the even the extremities of protesters. They're aiming for the torsos and the heads. And we've seen this footage on Twitter. We've seen it on social media. We're not seeing it in the U.S. media the same way that White Helmet's footage from Syria was played on a virtual feedback loop for the last two years to induce the U.S. bombing of Syria. And we know why.